Well, oh my God, what am I going to do? They're going to execute me in a few hours. I don't know what I'm going to do. It's just, yeah, it's crazy. But you know what? I'm not going to lose hope. I know. Okay, Ruby. You lost meals here. Oh, great. Burger, a Coca-Cola, and a string cheese stick, just like you requested. <sighs> yeah, thank you so much. Just please go leave my cell now. I want to eat alone. I want to eat in peace. Excuse me, I'm watching you, and don't you ever talk to me like that again. Look, is it, did my lawyer call you back? Like, am I getting a stay? Um, um nope. So far, nope. Your lawyer has not called you back. Great, this is just great. <coughs> <coughs> and I've been real sick for the past few days in my cell. They really want to execute a sick woman? Hmm. Ruby, can I come in? Who who are you? I'm your attorney. You are? Yes, I am. Oh my gosh. I haven't seen you in a long time. Can you come here, please? Oh my gosh. You look a lot different. Like, did you change? You changed a lot. You're... Yeah, I haven't had my hair cut in about four months. I haven't, been, I haven't been to the salon in a while to get my hair cut. And I lost my glasses, by the way. Well... I'm sorry about that. It's okay. I'm getting. I'm using contacts, and new glasses are getting pretty expensive these days. So I just bought. I'm just gonna deal with it. And I've learned how to see better. Anyway, I'm kind of used to it. I like your hair actually better how it is now. Well, um, thank you, but I am gonna get it cut again soon because I just I like it shorter. But whatever, it's your hair. You can do what you want. Exactly. So, what's the news? Am I going to be getting a stay of execution? What, really? We're doing everything we can for you, but don't lose hope. I know it's going to work out. Yeah, I'm not losing hope. I'm doing everything I can for you, Ruby. You're going to be okay. I'm doing everything I can. I'm not worried at all. I know I'm going to be spared. I, I, I know it. You truly think you're going to be spared? I know I will. Like, I, I really know I will. Well, I did call the governor's office. I called the judge. I called everybody. And, um, <clears throat> I still haven't gotten a phone call back, but, um, I'll be getting one soon. Well, I just hope you can get me out of this. I, I'm, tr I'm trying not to lose faith. I know in Jesus that I will live. Well, I believe so too. We're just, we're going to keep praying. We're going to keep hoping. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. You are? Hello? Okay. W what is it? Hold on a second. I'm sorry. The client isn't happy. Okay, bye. Ruby, I'm sorry. I have bad news for you. I can't help you anymore. What? The governor is okay with the execution. The judge has declined to make a stay. Your execution is actually going to happen in a few hours. I'm sorry, Ruby. I can't help you anymore. I I'm sorry. <gasps> no! Ruby, get up. It's time for your execution. What? No, 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 no. I, 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 I still have an hour left to live. I don't care. No, 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 no. Please, please, please. You, you really don't want to do this. Like, you, you don't want to kill me. Please don't kill me. Like, you know you don't want to do this. Like, you really know you don't want to do this. I don't care. I don't have a choice. It's been ordered by the state that you're to be put to death. I did not get to choose to do this, Ruby. I'm sorry. You're going to have to come with me. No, 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 no. You're not going to execute me. You're going to come with me willingly, or am I going to have to drag you? You're going to have to drag me. No, 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 no. No, no. You're not going to put me to death. No, no. No, 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 no. Ow, 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 let go of me. Ow, ow, no, stop, stop. Ow, let go of me. Stop, stop. Stop! Let go of me! Let go of me! <laughs>
Hey, stop kicking me. Let me go. 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 Okay, Ruby. You have any last words you want to say? Let me go. Let me go. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. You know you don't want to do this. Well, Ruby, Walker's here to watch your execution for you. Your friend's here, by the way, Ruby. Someone wants to say hi. Ruby, I am so sorry. I did everything I could for you, Ruby. I am so, so sorry. <laughs> I don't want to die. Ruby, do you have a final statement? I'm sorry for what I've done. I'm very sorry. And I will go live with every day of what I've done. But please don't kill me. I didn't plan to kill this girl. I didn't know what was coming. I didn't know I would end up doing this. But please don't kill me. Please. I'm so sorry for what I've done. Just please. Please don't kill me. Please. Ruby, your victim said the exact same thing when you murdered her. When you... She told you several times to stop. You, you knocked her out with poison gas. She was actually still alive, and you could have just decided to let her live, but you did it. You kept cutting her up with a chainsaw after she was screaming for you to stop. She died of blood loss. You could have let her go when she told you to and not killed her. Instead, you did what you did, and you made that choice, Ruby. I am sorry, but this... And you should have taken the plea deal if you wanted to live, but you didn't do that. So as a result, this is what's going to happen. Okay, let's check the phone. Let's check the phone. Okay, there's no more phone calls from the governor's office or anything. Okay. Execution may proceed. What are you doing? Oh! It hurts. Oh! This is what you get as a punishment for what you've done to that girl. Oh! To be honest, Ruby, I don't feel sorry for you one bit. Your toady may have forgiven you, but I don't, I'm not a religious person. I don't believe that there's forgiveness when you take a person's life. I, and, what you, and I agree, you should be put to death. I don't have a choice, but I agree with the state. I'm going to kill you anyway. Inject second needle. <laughs> ah! oh, oh! This shouldn't be painful. You're just faking it. Just so I don't kill you. It hurts. Ow. Well, you need to feel the pain that you made your victim feel. And I'm sure the victim's family would have loved to see this happen to you. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so I'm sorry. I, I, I can't believe. Well, Ruby. You see how it feels when you want to hurt someone? You see how it feels? <gasps> Please stop. No, Ruby. You need to feel the pain that you caused your victim. She needs justice. I don't care how much you've changed. You still have to pay for what you did many years ago. It doesn't matter how good you've changed or how good of a person you've become. You've had enough time. You spent 12 years on death row on our tax dollars. We paid for your clothing. We paid for feeding you. We even paid for your hair, which male inmates don't get those privileges. They. So we have to pay for your hair, your food, your clothes, your shelter. And you actually get a lot more privileges than the male death row inmates. So I don't even want to hear it from you. Twelve years in prison is long enough. Injects final drug. Oh! Okay. I'm gonna feel a pulse. We're gonna see if she's dead. Oh my god. What, what, what happened? Oh my god. Is she okay? Let's check her. I feel like. Oh my god. I just. I, I feel like this execution was botched. Like Ruby's in so much pain. Let's feel a heart. She has no pulse. What is it? She's gone. We did everything we could for her. I know you did everything you could for her, but she's gone. Ruby's gone. I I, I can't even know what to say. Like I I I, I thought I did everything. I think Ruby believed truly till the end that she was gonna live. Well, 
the state. Well, this is what she gets for killing that girl. Oh, you stop it right now. You stop it right now because the Bible says that you can forgive those and that G and that and what about this? Paul killed a bunch Saul killed a bunch of Christian people, but he turned to God and um, he became Paul. Well, that's just a Bible story. It's more than a Bible story. It's the truth in the Bible. Well, I'm not a Christian. I don't know anything about it. I don't read the Bible. I don't even... Well, maybe you should read the Bible. Because the Bible... Because, um... Well, you should probably start reading the Bible. Because it probably would help you a lot. And I pray that God helps you. Yeah, I don't care. I'm just... Ruby got what she deserved. The state wanted to put her to death because that's not how they saw it. <sighs> well, she's in a better place at home with Jesus. I taught her, I ministered to her for several years while she was on death row. She's in home with Jesus now. Yeah, she's probably in hell rotting. Oh, you stop it. She's in heaven. Yeah. You have to be a good person to go to heaven. You also have to believe in Jesus to go to heaven. No, you have to just be a good person. I'm so sorry you're lost. I'm so sorry you're very religious. Now I better go clean up her cell. It's disgusting. Ruby. What you did was horrible. But you became a very good friend to me while on death row. I will miss you, Ruby. Jesus loves you, Ruby. And even though you're no longer alive, I hope that... I hope there's peace upon you. I hope God had mercy on your soul, which I believe He did. Because the Bible says, those who repent and turn to Jesus can go to heaven. And I truly believe Ruby has repented and she was sorry for her actions. I believe that Right until the very end, that she was actually going to be spared, but the state wanted to kill her. Ruby was a born-again Christian. She repented, turned from her sins, but the state didn't see it that way, and they wanted to execute her. But Goodbye, Ruby. I will miss you, Ruby. That's just sad. I, I taught her several years ago in my class. It's just pretty sad to see that this is what she decided to do with her life, become a murderer, and end up being executed. It's pretty sad that she made bad decisions, but she didn't have a family. She had no one to love her, but I love her no matter what. Would you like to claim the body of Ruby Miller? Because if not, we're going to bury her in the prison cemetery. Yes, I'll take her body, and we're going to have a memorial service for her. Farewell, you better take the body, because I'm about to put it in the prison cemetery. I'm going to take the body, and I'm going to bring it to a funeral home. And